Yo, what's up? We decided to go on a little road trip for three days. Now we are already in Connecticut. We want to go uh, north to Vermont. Uh, we saw this cool lake here, so we want to take some pictures here at this location. And the next stop uh, will be a Walmart because we would like to see the American hugeness. So, Lou is preparing the camera stuff. Yeah, this is gonna be good. I uh, might need some uh, ND filter on it. I will see, I'm just gonna grab everything with me and then um, have a good shot. That's what it is. All right. You see, we got this uh, cheap compass. Not very powerful, but enough for the work it has to do. If we say we make a road trip, we are making a real road trip using the small roads okay let's pass this yeah. all right so mo um how comes that you do your channel in english um i wanted to do it in german actually but uh, a lot of friends uh, told me they want to hear it in English because they don't speak German. I have a lot of friends abroad and yeah. yeah, they were complaining they don't understand a thing, you know? Yeah, that is <laughs> that is fully understandable. I mean, like you can't just like talk in German and separate all your friends abroad. And it also, um, it's a good way to practice English because English is not my native language, obviously, but uh, you have to speak a language to learn it properly. That's yes, why, uh, I do agree with that, especially uh, the training this. part. Here outside of the city, everything looks real American, not like in New York, but, but New York is not real America. Here you have the whiteness. All right, we're in a small town where you can see the to tornado food houses, <laughs> all wooden and cheap built, like the standard American quality. <laughs> can you hold the camera, please? Yeah, sure. Yeah, but it's it's uh, more like the original America here, like you you know it and you have it in mind. Of course, a soldier statue over there. Yeah, they... They are heroes here. And... They hype them. But it's okay. I like that, actually. So we are pretty close to our first stop, the Walmart. Yeah, we want to see that because uh, in New York, you don't really have, like, big malls and shops just small ones and yeah we want to see the american way of living yeah <laughs> all right see you there we arrived at the walmart and now we're gonna check out how it is inside of whoop 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 yeah, everything is a little bit bigger than in New York, but I think we still are in a very small Walmart. Yeah, that's true. Right? It's not as big as expected. <laughs> that's what she said. <laughs> Lou is gonna buy some diabetes. Cookie dough bites and M&M's. Have you seen any real food here? Oh, I'm still looking for the Me right one. Neither. So look at that. 
Looking for real food. This big bad boy. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I found coffee nut and toffee nut. Lou got got some mac and cheese mac and from cheese. the Louisiana. 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 No. <laughs> Louisiana. 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 There you go. Took Difficult me. word. Ages. <laughs> Yeah, we are a little bit uh, disappointed from um, of this Walmart here because it's not huge and big how we expected. So we probably gonna look for another one where everything is huge, not like here. It's like yeah, almost like a German store, like a bigger German store. Yeah, right. Definitely. Yeah. Uh, so. We're gonna find one and we also wanna drive this this bikes for fat people. So but <laughs> but we but there are no so it's not a real Walmart here. And hope we're gonna find one and see you there. For me it's not not food for me. <laughs> it's yeah, it's like I don't like it. It's like it tastes like nothing. Just salty and sodium. <laughs> yeah, it's it tastes like low quality food. Which, but it's that's true. that. Yeah, but that's uh, uh, is what you want when you get yeah. fast food, some junk food, right? Mm. So we have been on the way to uh, nature preserve, and on the way we have seen this beautiful spot here. Wow, that's so cool. <laughs> Here with the ice on the lake. Yeah, the more we go north, the colder it gets. Look at this. You taking pictures of the sky? Yeah. <laughs> Because it's really, really nice. <laughs> nice. That word. That's bad, bad word. Yo, know, we found something interesting here on the way. In the middle of nowhere on the road. And I mean, it's still Christmas and. This looks so beautiful. Oh, it's slippery here on the, on the ground on the street. Look, look at all this Christmas decoration. I've never seen such a thing before. So cool. <laughs> Did you take some pictures? I think uh, someone else had the same idea. <laughs> Over there. I also want to take some pictures. Yo guys, we are in Akawam right now. It's uh, close to Springfield in Massachusetts. We decided to sleep in an Airbnb instead of the car. Yeah, because we are a little bit tired, we got up early, less sleep, so we decided to have a good sleep today. So we are fit on our road trip, and we have this very cozy room here. How much is it? It's about thirty-five. So wow. forty dollars, right? Uh, Around yeah, about uh, thirty-six dollars or something. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Oh, uh... I told you in another video in US, you have to pay a lot for accommodation. Um, I mean, you pay forty dollars for just a private room, shared bathroom, shared everything, and I think that's the cheapest you can go here. If you want to have a private area, you 
always have to pay around about a hundred dollars a night I mean of course it depends on location and season but that's what you yeah, have to expect uh, but it's pretty comfortable here the owners are also very very friendly we had a very warm welcome maybe we see them tomorrow in the morning before we leave so that's it for day number one and we're about to approach day two yeah, yeah. <laughs> oh yeah and we also have a new team member it's a helmut hello helmut the katze helmut the cat the katze. yeah